There we go. Yeah. What up, Jag? What up, B? What's happening with it, man? Yo, I was saying we didn't really do a recap when you when when you came on after the battle was on for like ten minutes real quick. You ain't really get to talk like that. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So now the battle's over. How you feeling? Talk to me. What's up? What, what's your thoughts on all of this? Hey, first off, I'm feeling good. You know what I'm saying? Like a lot of niggas be talking they shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I see a couple of bloggers talking they shit, man. But for the most part, I've been getting hit up from a lot of rappers, a lot of top tier rappers. Now I see rappers that's not top tier mentioning my name, you know what I'm saying? And I don't want to mention their name because they out here looking for battles and shit like that. Listen, man, I, I was in that spot before. It's amazing, though, that y'all 30-plus battles in and you in that spot that I was in before my first battle. <laughs> okay. Looking okay. for a battle. First, okay. first, off, shout out, first off, shout out to fucking O-Red. You know what I'm saying? He stood his ground for, for a first round. You know, um, first off, what I want to say to niggas, man, listen, man, you know, niggas like to take away what I did. You know, niggas say, oh, your best performance was math. Well, math is better than O-Red. Um, so that's what it is. The level of competition, however high the level of competition is, I'm going to step up to that. I did what I had to do to beat O-Red. I knew what I, what I, that I was coming to beat O-Red. This is a battle. It's called battle rap. The point is to win the motherfucking battle. You remember watching the movies where they fighting in the Roman days? You know what I'm saying? And, and, and the motherfuckers win a, win a war. Them niggas be half dead. Nigga be one leg. You know what I'm saying? Crawling back to the fort, but they won. And them niggas, and he, shit, and if he lived to survive, them niggas gonna talk about the motherfucking story. Guess who lived, though? Guess who lived to survive? Jag did. I heard O'Red was undefeated on RBE, bro. Yeah? I heard O'Red was undefeated on RBE. And, he, and everybody's saying he took a clear loss to Jag, but but this ain't Jag's best performance. Jag beat O'Red, who undefeated. Hear me how this makes sense. Jag beat O'Red, who's undefeated on RBE, never lost. Just battled a nigga on RBE. Feel me? Mm -hmm. I'm following you. Never lost. But he get on big stage and everybody says, oh, Jag, clear one, two, one. How the fuck you clear win, two, one, but your shit was trash? Please stop playing with me. Mm -hmm. Go, go. Look at the clips I'm posting. Listen to the crowd. Am I delusional? Am I not hearing a fucking crowd go fucking wild? What am I watching? What the fuck am I hearing? You mm. feel me? Because <laughs> apparently and you, and you win, you win off of that. The crowd, the crowd damn so was reacting. They damn so was laughing at old Red How I know because I'm posting clips on my gram. You know what I'm saying? You can go to my you can go to my gram, my my profile, and I'm post I'm posting videos every day. I'm gonna post videos every day on how the crowd was reacting to why I was bombing on that nigga. You know what I'm mm. saying? And that just is what it is. My nigga took an L. Niggas don't know how to take L's, and, and people that went for the nigga don't know how to be, don't know how to man up and just say, "Hey, I went for O'Red and, and we lost." Instead, niggas want to take the victory away from <laughs> that. I talked to ARP. You know what he said? ARP a real nigga. He said, "Guess what, Jack? You can't take away what you did. Mm. You can't take away what you did in that ring, bro. I'm still right there. You can't take away what you did." You got booed first round on the biggest stage ever. Your first time on a big stage. Your first time, Jay. You stood there like nothing happened after the first round. Mm. And then whipped on them. Mm. So ARP like, nigga, don't let nobody tell you. Like, you, you can't take what, take away what you did. And it is what it is. You beat O'Red. You beat like you O'Red. Like you said, this is battle rap. The object is to win the battle. That's it. That's it. The object is to win, and he didn't. It wasn't even debatable. Mm. Jag got the last two rounds. It wasn't even debatable. I clearly won. So what we talking about? Oh, the, everybody, uh, yo, this this ain't no upset. How they no fucking upset? And the man never lost. You think so? So the first nigga beat on Floyd. The first nigga that beat on Floyd. You what y'all gonna say? This ain't no upset. Now nah, you're this right. Fucking upset. He nah, lost. You're right. And he lost Let's be real here. You were supposed to lose. As far as him being a bad rapper for all these years, you were supposed to lose. Hitman was supposed dragged, to lose. Bro. That's my point. I was, supposed to, I was supposed to get dragged. Yeah. He said he was going to drag you. 
and, and, and then and, watch and, your boss get dragged by Hitman. That that that's what he and, said. And guess and guess who won out of that battle? Guess guess what team? Guess what team? All these niggas hate, but won <laughs> on the night they were supposed to win. Motherfucking wow. motherfucking larceny, mayhem, goat game. We the niggas who been hated on. Cap, you know I've been trying to get in the game for how long? Years. 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 For we years. We both be on the same stage on the same night, and guess who show up? Guess who show up? The squad that they hate the most. So you think people ain't going to talk they shit and hate and nitpick and try to find shit to say Jag didn't do good? Them the niggas mm. that's hating, bro. Why my mm. comments got all these blue checks? Why the fuck did Antonio Brown Reach out to me at four something in the morning, and you saw the screenshot, Cap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He did. He did. He did. We're talking he about one of the best wide receivers in the motherfucking game. He called nigga, him a legend. Nigga just got him a ring with the Bucks. What is y'all saying? Niggas ain't in old red, do you? <laughs> we talking about Antonio Brown. These niggas gotta stop playing with me. Why is oh, niggas from Wilding now, Out? Why is niggas from Wilding Out saying? Why is niggas from Wilding Out saying you one of the best to ever do it from the West? Why is Watts homie Quan? Why is Watts homie Quan who on Wilding Out with Hitman and Holler saying you one of the best to ever do this shit from the city, Jack? And that's off the old Red Battle. Yeah. 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 Yo, can I be real? So, so I'm fuck all that. Too. Fuck all Yo. that. Niggas saying the bloggers saying this and that. And, and, and two hating ass rappers, fuck all that. What they saying, them niggas not important. I told you niggas, I'm going at the big name. So you two little niggas who try to uh, mention my name okay, and talk about shit, I'm not even mentioning y'all fucking name because you niggas ain't big enough for me. You know what I'm saying? The bag not even big enough to be talking to me about nothing. So the nigga who was on here before me, you know what I'm saying? When you was on live earlier, the nigga who was on here before me, hey, listen, my G, look at my face, nigga. Do I look move? You're not fucking with me, dog. You can get on your interviews and talk about Jag and say whatever the fuck you want to say bad about Jag. Nigga, guess what? You won't get in the ring with Jag. You know why? Because you're not a fucking top nigga, dog. You're not a god tier ass nigga. So nah, nah. Swave bitch. Swave a top nigga. Swave a top nigga. Come on. He's not. I ain't no god tier nigga. I want the bag. And nobody want to see Jag. Oh, god tier. God tier. God tier. God tier. I'm talking to niggas like Shotgun, Sugar, and Arsenal. Why, I'm talking, why would I talk to him? What, what type of bag I'm going to get battling him? I'm still not going to say his name. What type of bag I'm going to get battling him? Huh? Wait a minute. I don't... I don't. Compared to Arsenal, we're talking about a nigga who got the most views in battle rap. But what about but what about Shook, though? See, I know you've been wanting Shook. Is Shook that... Shook, is he that much over Shook is just a personal thing, Cap. You know that. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. It's a personal thing with you and Shook. Yeah. I, I don't know if Shook is that is, is over swayed, honestly. Nah, but, 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 but the narrative behind it you know what I mean? It's so uh, huge. Yeah, you, yeah, y'all been going back and forth for bad long. Yeah. Now you were clean. I don't know where that started from, right there. But I see what you're saying. With, with, all right, you're not interested in clean paper. All right, cool. I don't even now, know, this, dude. I don't even listen. I seen dude. I seen dogs. I seen dogs a couple times. Dogs. You know what I'm saying? I seen them. <laughs> I seen them a couple times. Dogs. You know what I'm saying? Like I, <laughs> I seen them a few times, but like I don't, I don't know, dude. Yo, like, Jack. I, yo, I think it's clean on his eight. Sway on his eight game, and you on your eight game. That would be. Fire! I'm telling Damn. you. I know. I hear what you're saying. I hear what you're saying. That I heard, would be I heard fire. Is, I heard O'Red on his A game is scary. Yo, you know what? You know what? I can't say nothing. I can't say nothing. I gotta stop. I gotta stop hearing that now, Cap. I gotta stop hearing. Nigga said, "Don't make O'Red mad." Don't. Yo, make, don't make O'Red mad. When he's mad, bro. Huh? Let, let, I, hold on, hold on. Let's have a five minute segment on it. I know you don't want it. On, Here's my thing about it, right? It's your your style. Like you said, when you first came in years ago, I want to battle the bullies. I got all your interviews on the show. I know what you're looking for. You feel me? I know you want the bag. And I, I trust me, I get that. All I'm saying is this. Shout out to my jeweler. Shout out to my jeweler, Jimmy the jeweler. You know what I'm saying? Fifteen thousand dollar. You know what I'm saying? Fifteen thousand dollar bust down Cuban VVS's. You know what I'm saying? LT L two H. You know what I'm saying? Done right. Y'all want your jewelry done right, man. Go to Houston and get it done by done right. Jimmy the jeweler, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what it is. Fuck O'Reilly. He lost. Yo, but look, hit me out. Hit me out. We, we, want, we want to talk. Because I see you taking off. Hold on. Because I, I was seeing some things on Facebook that I want to address with you right now. Right? But Swave kind of ties into it. I've seen people say right now that you and Cassidy came back 
And and don't get it confused. I'm not saying y'all did more than what anybody else did for RBE. But they definitely said y'all came back and y'all are like spearheading this right now. Well, matter of fact, I don't even want to put Cassie in it. You, because you had three battles on RBE. They, I definitely seen it where it's just like, yo, niggas can say what they want, but Jag is consistently battling on RBE. And, and like you you're not losing. You're not losing. The object is to win. That's what you're doing. Yeah. Yeah. That's what you're doing. Yeah. Now. Listen, I, 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 give a fuck, I give a fuck what niggas' personal ass opinion is about me. You know why? Because people, the, the, at the end of the day, when the majority come out, is still saying that I'm winning and I'm still getting booked for the next battle, mean that I ain't, I'm not hurting the numbers. Niggas got to start thinking and doing their fucking math on this shit. Feel mm. me? It's, it's, it, I must be doing something right. My promo must be doing something right to where niggas is. You know what I'm saying? Getting bread and doing what they're able to do off of Jag doing what he do. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm not I'm not hurting the problem. Feel me? I'm not hurting it. I'm only I'm only adding on. And, 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 and shout out to RBE and ARP for seeing that. You know what I mean? And yeah, I've been consistently battling on RBE because that's who consistently booking me. You know what I'm saying? And giving me a shot to do what I do. And ARP gave me a shot. I was supposed to show myself. You know what I'm saying? Pause and do and, and do what I what I was supposed to do on that stage and leave with a win. And guess what I did? I left with a win. So now when ARP get to booking some more shit, guess what? He ain't going to have no problem booking Jag because Jag come 100% with the promo and Jag still win for some reason. For some reason. <laughs> niggas can't get Jag off the stage. Mm. For some reason, Cap. But Jag whack. It don't make sense to me, but okay, Jag whack. <laughs> I'll take that. Niggas start Tim Duncan with swag. You know what I'm saying? You not you might not like my game. You might not like how I shoot the, the turnaround bank shot. You know what I'm saying? But listen, yeah, me, Ginobili, and Tony Parker gonna go get these rings. That's a dope analogy. Feel me? Yeah. I yeah. feel like that. Yo, that yo, that's how I always felt about Carmelo Malone for some weird reason. I hate it. I hate it. But Utah was doing their thing. Can't you and two, to be honest with you. Is you and like they were doing their thing. My game and it is what it is. I know how to get the job done. Mm. Now look, now job, look. I, want to, I got a backtrack. I got a backtrack. Now this is the reason why I'm bringing this name up because he can battle on RBE. Fans want to see you and, and ill will. I'm seeing and ill will. I'm seeing. Fans want to see, and I know you're going for the bag, Big K. You know what I'm saying? That show off. There's what? battle. I know you want. I know you got. You got perfect. Show off. Show off. Show off. Just you're got trying to get Arsenal. Sean huh? just got 30. That's my brother, but uh, he just got 30. And right. that, that, that that wouldn't be a good battle for us next. I, I would need I need Show Off to go and do what Show Off really do and kill a nigga next so that we can get in the ring and it makes sense promo-wise. Show Off know what I'm talking about. I'm talking just business-wise and for the bag. It just don't make sense for me and Show to get in right now. You hear what I'm saying? What about Rosenberg Raw? Because he did beat he, – he's the one who 30 Show Off. But – I, I like I like Raw. Be honest, be honest, be honest, be honest. Nah, not name that you feel like his buzz ain't big enough. Keep be honest. Nah. All right, look, let's do it like this. Cause all right, I see where you're coming from. You winning battles, niggas is not getting you off the stage. You feel like yo, I'm doing supposed to be doing so. You can choose at this point. I, you're going for Arsenal. You're going for you for Shug. So clearly, you're going for the top names. Boom. Clean name isn't big enough for you right now. Nah. Raw name isn't big enough nah. for you right. now. Swave name? Nah. Swave name not big enough? Nah. Nah. All right, all right, all right. It will. It will. His name big enough. That's it will my, name that, big That's enough. my brother, but I would get in with Will. You know what I'm saying? We can go get a nice little bag because I know what Will going to bring to the table, man. You know what I'm saying? He definitely going to do better than what all Red did. Feel me? Wow. I, I always looked at it. I, yo, I'm trying to be real true. I always looked at it. For, they, even though their styles are not the same. I look at like L. Will and O. Red, uh, in a, in a different way. They they kind of the same to me in a, in a sense. It's weird, on the same status. I like, I feel like O. Red's a monster. I know you just I know you just beat him. I know you do, but I've been watching this nigga for years. I know what he. You know what I'm saying I don't that doesn't erase what he's done for years. Yeah, but it's different when you come see 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 what battle with battle rap, and I'm starting to realize with the bloggers and a lot of niggas don't understand. Energy is more powerful than anything. Energy. And okay. when this energy, you know what I'm saying, leak off on you, pause, 
uh, uh, you know, in, in, in a bad way and you uh -huh. don't know how to handle it, it's going to show. Don't matter what O'Reilly, I kept telling everybody, don't matter what O'Reilly did before me, dog. He got to mm -hmm. stand in front of me and take him. He was saying that. He was saying that. He was what? saying that. Yeah. Whole time. Whole time. You were saying that. I ain't going to lie. You was. You know, I'm keeping it 100, bro. You got to stand in front of me and deal with this motherfucking energy. Feel now me? Now, look. Now, let me ask you this. Now, let me ask, do you feel like maybe you bringing the energy is what the uh, is what critics? Because I don't even know who you're really talking about. You keep saying bloggers and whatnot. I don't know what you're talking about. But I guess critics they don't know. See they know. Me. They know. The bloggers know who say who 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 be talking this stupid ass shit. Okay. Okay. But do, do you feel like you feel like you're bringing energy to the battle? Also, and that's not being seen, maybe or what? Yeah, I know okay. that because battle rappers have told me that. A hit me up and it, said, this Jack. is my whole thing about it, bro. This <laughs> is my whole thing. Avert hit me up and said, Jack, this was needed, bro. We need it a is. like you. It is. Feel me? It is. I'm keeping 100. You, bro, you jump straight like, yo. See, people ain't really been watching like that. That's what it is. I've been so in tune, I know what's going on. But, like, bro, you had to do a phone, like, damn near do a phone battle just to have some type of footage where people could be like, yo, I'm Jag. I was winning in Fight Club in the, in the pit down here. And that, uh, no one knew none of this. You, had to, you did that twice, which got you buzzing for a little second. Had you buzzing. No, you had to gradually make your way in. And it's not like you came in and you getting washed. You ain't making no kind of noise. You literally have came in and it's just like, yo, three solid battles. Yeah. Three. Even if fans say, oh, I don't, I don't like this. I'm, bro, you've been gone 15 years. This is my thing with the Cassidy and Hitman battle. I don't want to grade it on a curve at all. At the end of the day, if, if, if niggas been gone 15 years and you've been doing this for the past 10, 15 years, this is your house. Y'all should be beating them. Yeah. That's just what it is, I feel like. Nigga came in your house and beat your ass. And he ain't, and he ain't pick up a... He ain't do nothing in 15 years. Let's not forget that part. <laughs> the break. The, the real... This is my thing with Mook, too. This is my thing with Mook, too. Hey, Mook this, Mook that. Mook came back after years and years and didn't lose. He didn't lose. Niggas don't be liking Series Jones. Series Jones don't be losing. Y'all from an era where the object is to beat your opponent. Yeah. Niggas is real used to being, to seeing uh, 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 performances and, yeah. you know, that battle was born. Who won do it, the how battle, they you do it. They'll, take, they'll say the shit whack, even though you won. Yeah. He won in a whack battle, but he won. I keep he won though. The object is to win. Y'all won about the replay value. Which the object is actually to win. Yeah. Who rap that better? That's being lost battle in battle rap. rap right now. It's battle rap. It's who rap better at the end of the night. That's what the fuck this is, and I rap better. Like come on, man. It has to be a winner. There has to be a loser. A loser. We can say debatable all we want, but like if somebody wins, you got it. You they won. Once you run down their resume, Cap, that the win nigga, goes on their resume. The only nigga in battle rap that they doing this to. A nigga clearly, and everybody saying he clearly. Nah, it ain't just you. It's Sirius Jones they be doing it too, too, bro. Yeah, true. You're right. He clearly, clearly, they'll say, oh, yeah, Jack clear, clearly beat him. But, yeah, it wasn't good. 40 cows, same thing. Yeah, it wasn't a good, but he won. Yeah, this is what y'all wanted. You know, now, okay. I can understand you want the bar to upgrade and get better. I'm not bad at that. What I'm trying to say is, like, don't forget he won. And that's Thanks. the object of what, the, what that, that's the, the whole Thanks. objective. Look, of, even with the, the bars, whole reason why we watch get battle better. rap. Even with the bars to get better, that's all bullshit. Because, like I said, that's why I'm posting clips. You go to the clips and you hear what the fucking crowd is doing. You know how big that crowd was? <laughs> was the whole crowd. Not just one section. The whole crowd. That's the same crowd that booed me. You know that, right? Mm. So if we say better punchlines or, or better rap, how? When the crowd went crazy, that's how I won. Mm. That's how I won cap off rap. I didn't do no dance. I didn't bring my little brother out there to run in a nigga face. I rapped. That's why they say mm. he lost 2-1. So how mm. these people say they want me to rap better when I clearly beat a nigga 2-1 who's undefeated? Mm. That makes no sense. I want me to rap like God.
I'm just God's son. I can't give y'all the full gods yet, y'all. Y'all got to hold and on. Then, you got to keep it 100 for everybody saying, yo, I see it wasn't the best old red. Like, I got to, like, that's old red fault. That's my whole thing about it. If you're going to blame someone, you got to blame him. You got to blame him. Who you can't say that, yo, Cassie was whack, Cassie was whack. Nah, you got to say, yo, Hitman was whack. Old red voice went out. Every time somebody get to barking on Old Red, he get to losing his voice. <laughs> Feel me? You can see all the you can see all the clues that I body them. You can see the clues every time somebody get to barking on him, he loses his voice. He can't mm. take pressure, bro. And if you watch CC, this I know niggas ain't been watching details. You gotta watch this shit how you watch Coming to America, bro, a hundred times. Go back first round at the end of the first round. You know what I'm saying? at the end of O-Red first round, and I go into my second round. He's already doing some shit with his mouth. His tooth then fell out after the first round. <laughs> look, I don't Watch know his what he's doing. Watch his mouth. Watch when the second round start. Look at O-Red. Don't look at me. Look at O-Red. He's on stage like this. I know because uh, 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 ARP says something, and he said, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to do something. I remember I seen it. Yeah. And it was like, I ain't know what you, I thought I know this fucking tool. Boy. He trying to fix the dentures, man. You know what I'm saying? I wrapped them dentures out. How them niggas going to disrespect me and say a nigga ain't rap good and I wrapped this nigga dentures out? You feel me? This nigga, he got me fucked up, nigga. His dentures <laughs> came out. He lost his voice. This was, yeah, everybody, this wasn't the best <laughs> way. You know why? Because he got fucking beat. Of course, dumb dumbs. This, ain't, this wasn't the best already. No shit, nigga. He lost. Clear. <laughs> How you gonna get the best old red if he lost? People so stupid. Like, come on, man. I like when Jordan loses or something. Like, yeah, that wasn't the best Jordan. No shit. That's why he lost. Mm. Stop fucking playing. We know it wasn't the best old red. That's the best he was gonna do against me. Mm. Clear. We saw that. I think it's sad. I think it's sad. <laughs> Nigga loses his voice and teeth coming out. Like, come on, sir. Come on, man. Niggas don't want to get embarrassed, man. Niggas don't want to get embarrassed. You feel me? And, and, and it's okay, man. You know, hey, O-Red, your battle could have went a whole different if you would have accepted your teeth. What if you, you mean? accepted your dentures. When I got on Angry Fan with, 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 that morning, when I got on Angry Fan that morning, you know what I'm saying, with you, O-Red, and I first got on and I started talking about your teeth and you lied and said it's a retainer, guess what? The battle could have went a different way if you would have said, so what, nigga, I got dentures. I got into a fight with a grown man. I was a little kid and got my whole grill knocked out. Nigga, hey, I would have had to change my shit around. Mm. It wasn't even, what, it wasn't even funny no more. Guess what, O'Red? You was playing checkers and not chess, nigga. You know how you mm. see how, you see how O'Red mentioned Mitchell and S? And then I came back with Mitchell and S? You see how I, I was prepared for certain things that O'Red was going to say? Mm. Because O'Ray was playing checkers, not chess. And mm. that's why he really lost. He really lost. Because if he would have stood up like a man and said, nigga, I got a fake grill, so what? I'm ugly. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, people would have <laughs> accepted him more. Okay. And I would have had to switch up my round because I would have knew, like, damn, this nigga ain't. You know what I mean? I done talked mm. about this shit and he accepted it. Feel me? Okay, no, you want a clip question. now? A whole it's a whole clip on Uber and all type of shit on you because your dumb ass, you know what I'm saying? Out here yeah. looking stupid. Yo, all right, so question, boom. Now you be O Red. How close? All right, if out of you got both of them on the table right now, sugar arsenal, which one we taking? Cap, so you saying you saying when I told them you saying when I told them my guy, listen, if I want to order a biscuits, an apple pie with the fries and the fried chicken. New Jersey baller, I bet I have a thigh missing, a pie missing, or even a fry missing. Or you going to be with the rest of the Nets in the sty twitching with your eye missing? We different red. Like, Cap, you wasn't laughing? Yeah. Yeah. I rest my fucking case. I rest my case. You wasn't there, and I had you laughing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Imagine what it was so, so there. But hold up, but Jag, but Jag, you got sugar, you got Arsenal in front of you right now. Which one you taking first? You and uh, Sugar's personal. Whichever you pick. and Arsenal's the most views. Whichever bag look right. Fuck the views. Okay. Be the one gonna get views because my promo wild and they gonna lose. So okay. you know what I'm saying? 
uh, so I take he's sure one. First, they offer more money for Shug. Yeah, I want Shug to you give would, him. You really money. got a personal grudge with Shug, really, in a sense. Like you really want to battle Shug him. Shug think he a bully. Shug think he a bully, man. I want him with that nigga. Cause he think he a bully. Yeah, and Arsenal, and Arsenal don't know what's happening. He think he's most disrespectful. So, so you want to out disrespect Arsenal? I take it. Yeah. Just, just, just to see what's up. Yeah, it's gonna be a disrespectful battle. Mm. Mm. It's wild, boy. Like, like, yo, I, I see what you're saying. Like, a lot of people, like, I would say, like, eighty percent at least thought Old Red was gonna beat you. So you're yeah. able to talk your talk. Like, you're yeah. able. You're able to. Uh, yeah, yeah. As I said, and it's the biggest car of Old Red career. Yeah, and he lost. He lost. Talk about it is, it, it is what it is. Talk about talk about niggas fucking up the opportunity. Mm. Yeah, you know what? Uh, shout out, shout out to my promo. You know, because a certain companies was looking at me do promo for an RBE battle, and got to hearing me talk about my songs on Drake's show Euphoria. They went and reached out, um, you know, to my management and got my catalog and and got that song that I had got placed on Drake's show and bought it from them and and, and, and bought it from me. So that now it could be on the TV show The Shy. Mm. So now that song that was placed on Drake's show is now on The Shy. This is what I'm saying. Certain moves that <coughs> I think will be able to bust, that I'm going to be able to bust. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to The Shy. Shout out to uh, uh, all the major uh, networks out there that's putting Jag music up. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, Chad Ocho Cinco. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Brandon Marshall. You feel me? Yeah, because we out. We out there, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see what the fuck going on. And I'm going to keep capitalizing, bro. That's what this is all about. That's what I told niggas. Capitalizing okay. off these battles. I'm not just here battling. I'm capitalizing. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my bro, J. Don Mickens. You know what I'm saying? Also, wide receiver from the uh, Tampa Bay Bucks. You know what I'm saying? We got a lot of a lot of work coming. We doing a lot of business together. Yeah, doing real business with niggas who getting real bags, who got Super Bowl rings. Oh, Red, you not. Mm. You won't. Okay. You won't. Shout out to Watts on me, Quan, for wilding out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Word. you know. Uh, uh, Hitman Holla Comrade. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Shout out to Watts on me, Quan, for saying I'm one of the best niggas to do it from here, man. You feel me? Niggas out here who really out here popping. Shout out to my nigga Sleek Johnson. You feel me? Black Jesus. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he hit me up too. Hey, shout out to the real niggas, man. Oh, Red, check this out, dog. You not me. You never gonna be me. You can't be. You know what I'm saying? You won't be. You gonna be old red for the rest of your life. And guess who that is? The nigga who was undefeated on RBE and lost to a nigga who was on his third battle and didn't mm. rap for 15 years on the stage. Mm. That's now that's the narrative. Mm. Okay. That's what it is. Feel me? Damn. Okay. <laughs> huh. Feel me? Damn. That's all I'm saying. Okay. Listen, my story's so wild, like, it could be a documentary shot on me. You shoot a documentary on Old Red, it's going to get sad at the end. Mine's going to be, you know what I'm saying, joyful, prosperous. You know what I'm saying? Old Red shit. You watch Old Red documentaries, like, damn, he went out there, he had it all in his hands. He, had, he was undefeated. And he lost to that nigga? That's how your story, your story fucked up. My story, <laughs> I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't battle for 15 years. I came back and Nobody could get me off of the stage. Not even a nigga who was undefeated in the league I was in. Man. Couldn't even Damn. get me off stage. Imagine that documentary. Damn. Damn, Red. <laughs> Damn, Red. Yeah, killing them again. I'm out here winning again. We ain't even battling no more. I'm still beating them to death. Kicking them to death. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I think it's that I'm still beating in the death. <laughs> Man. Yo. <sighs> all right, man. All right. Oh, his phone. I think his phone went out. Are you good? Yeah, I'm good. That's what it is. That's what it is. But, yo, I'm going to end it right here. I'm going to end it right here. This is perfect right here. You Let's know what I'm saying? It, I'm definitely going to get you back on. We definitely we trying to see the moves, man. Keep me in loop so we can see what's going on, B. Let's go. You know what it is. That's what it is. Yeah, what's the